so with Reggie, actually. They live about like five minutes. Wow, really? Yeah. Wow, FD game one. Yeah, Chris likes to favor FD game in a while. Uh, so Chris likes FD for the reason that, like, you can't use platforms to ever avoid, like, the basic just, like, spam wall of moves. Yeah. Like, your fairs, your nares, your everything. Oh, you really just ride that off the of way. We're going crazy off the start. I mean, oh, but I mean, Sinji firing back 46 immediately. That Nice job saving his jump from TK Chris there. Could have been disastrous if he didn't. No, seriously. If he upbeat it after something there, I don't know if he ever makes it back. I mean, like, the, the way that Sinji was, like, haunting those cherries to just catch him on the way there, it would have him. I know, actually, too, that Fruit and Hydrant, I believe, uh, cut the amount of distance PK Thunder Oh, yes, made. it does. But any it hitbox. As, yeah, but it counts as running into something. Yeah, any hitbox will shorten the PK Thunder distance in half. I'm surprised Hydrant didn't look there. Full PK Fire and Bell, and it's still alive. Had to have been, like, 1 HP, probably. Oh, wow! Whoa, nice. That was so That was sneaky. so sick! Damn. I thought, I thought that was just going to go like straight up through the stage, but it went up into like the left to the ledge. Yeah. You guys saw that too, right? Yeah, like, no, that was, that was like really creative from Sinji. Bell back on deck oh, there. Be and the yeah. smash yeah. going to do it. Pac-Man holding Bell when you're at kill percent is the best character in the game. It's so scary. He has everything. Also, that up that Sinji's doing is so good because... First of all, if you are in any sort of action that is not shield, you just get bounced immediately. And you're, that means if you get bounced, you're going to hit by the move. So you're immediately losing that interaction. And then pretty much that's Sinji's win condition in neutral. Exactly. And like you, you, can, you can even see him just plant, planting these trampolines in the middle of the stage. Because what is he going to do about PK firing it? Because it's just a wall now. Like, Sinji's using that trampoline as almost like a secondary fire hydrant when he can. Yep. Because, like, it, it takes the risk away of him getting hit by his own hydrant, but adds in the factor of that of the wall. Also, Sinji intentionally dropping that side B when he was shooting a projectile uh, for the heal, and then yep. he didn't heal. That pellet will heal some of your percent. It's, I believe it's 2%. Yeah, I think you're right. The Nair is going to do it, though, for PK Chris. Ooh, okay, riding the water. Also notice Sinji is playing on the ledge really well. A couple times I've seen TK Chris try to go for that yo-yo down smash to snuff out a kill. And Sinji's been playing on that ledge really well. Oh, almost not there, though. I don't though. know what it would look like, but what would the multi-hit of yo-yo do for Hydra? Like, do you think it would just, like, make it shake in place over and over again? Because I feel like that might be pretty good. It would. It like, makes it shake in place a little bit, and once you let it go, it goes to full distance. I'm wondering how Yuka about to be. Oh, good, good nice tag from, from Chris. Like, Sinji's edge guards this game have actually been insane though. Like, the amount of different like setups he's had while he's off stage or while Chris has been off stage has just been actually insane. I noticed he Sinji also is really incorporating dash attack into his game. Heavily slept on move from Pac-Man because no of the mobility lag. and it has no end lag. It's actually no end lag. It's, the so, it's that, insane. The second he gets out of that final dash attack hit, he's just actionable. Double down smash from Chris, oh, definitely gonna work there. But again, you see, like, immediately after that dash attack, he just up beat. He's also he, really good up beat out of shield as well. Because in that situation, you know that. Yep, yeah, like I was saying earlier, really, really good up beat out of shield option as well. Oh, the oh, bell yeah. back air. I, I was gonna say, that's too high for the up smash, so it's not gonna be game yet. But at this point, now Sinji just gets to play his game, and if he ever gets to have the time to charge up Bell, I mean, like, you barely can approach anymore. Yeah. Being down a whole stock against Pac-Man is so hard. Oh, yeah. Also, Being Sinji down. doesn't even want Bell right now. He's just assaulting him with these little fruits, like the cherries and the strawberries and oranges over and over again. They're all hitting. Telling the little kid, you gotta eat your fruits and vegetables really to good. be a big, strong boy. You can only become a Pac-Man like me. Eat all your fruits <laughs> and your vegetables. Right now, he's just a little oh, Pac-Man. I, Batter oh, okay. I got afraid. I got afraid. Almost hit him with the home run. run. The Aaron Judge out here. <laughs> Not doing it like enough. Anyway. And this oh, is like yeah, the, the yeah. prime position for like Pac-Man in general, because like Pac-Man with all Whoa, the that cherry! The, yeah. the, the super cherry that actually went so fast. But yeah, you think that would have killed? Yes, no. I think so. <laughs> no. With how fast it was going, I, I don't think, think it would. I, I, I don't the think damage, speed but maybe, is, yeah. maybe, maybe. Oh, that's gonna push him closer. Yeah, the, the water's like, I got you, fam. Yeah. Water with the assist.
Tiger's just so good in every matchup, but I can imagine for Ness, this has to be so obnoxious. Like, you constantly want to be using your aerials, and, like, you don't even have the most insane air drift, but you have the ability to, like, you know, like, use your moves and try to, like, fade in and out, but if Hydrant pushes you away at all, it messes up your entire game plan. And the second Ness is in the air, it's not like he's a fastball. You also, at least fall I was saying this. earlier, too, even though Pac-Man is great at, like, laying back, playing projectiles and such, Pac-Man is one of the best boxers in the game. Oh, 100%. Oh, they decided that every single zoner in this game could box. Rob, looking at you, Rob. Yeah, literally, we're looking at you, Rob. Why Rob has the best down tilt of all time, only Sakurai knows. Oh, that's a scary setup at ledge. What do we do, Olga? I mean, at that point, that's you don't have to do. hold ledge, but, but I mean, if you're holding ledge, Chris can charge that down smash and threaten you, you know what I mean? But that actually seems like a really solid ledge trap. Case for, uh, in point with Pac-Man being an uh, amazing uh, boxer. That should be it. That, that is not going yeah, to do yeah. it, though. I Chris going to make it back. I think if he could drop the high earlier, it would have been. Absolutely. But he wasn't able to get off stage. And I think it would have hit him out of the PK Thunder and forced Chris into a tech situation. Probably, yeah. Mm. Ooh, good Galaga. We're at even percent here, pretty much. It is really important that Chris is able to get the first stock here because Pac-Man with the lead is, in my humble opinion, almost unbeatable. It is really, really hard to be Pac-Man with the lead. Pac-Man with the lead is really strong because, of course, he never has to approach at that point. Like, you have all of the time and the ability in the world to, to do whatever you want. You can charge your fruit. You get to sit behind Hydra. Okay, oh, that that's a judgy and blast right that's there. That's out of the park. That, is, there, that Hydra had no even chance of going back to Sinji. He just wanted it out of the freaking game. <laughs> Oh, oh wow. the key? key. I feel like that. I feel like that is the easiest key to hit. Like when you finish charging it, just immediately throwing it. Go down air. Stop the yard key. is gonna do it. I, I, I'm sorry, that moves is like. Why would you give Pac-Man more stuff? To because he's cool. <laughs> he's not actually cool. I'm just trying to make it cute. Anyways, uh, <laughs> why did okay Pac-Man? I'll be going through. Next, oh, 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 okay. Okay, wait. That was actually insane. That was if he sick. Got, if he got the final one though. It would have actually been perfect. He almost had the Twitter. He almost had the Twitch clip, right? Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, hold on. S that would have went into a Twitter montage. S smash, S smash the hydrant again. Go. Nah, maybe, maybe later. He's done playing baseball. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He's, it's got to get sent to him first, you know. Now like, he wants to have the straw. What's a batter also, without a pitcher? Can we talk about how hard this bracket is today? This oh is yeah. Yeah. Winner's quarter finals. Sinji versus PK Chris. This is a normal week's winner is the final grand. Event. This feels yeah. like the peak warehouse days. Right? Like oh we're back. Like when we, we were have, getting like we 200 entrants a week. The people that you want to see coming out. Like it's crazy. This is such a good bracket. Honestly, just send off Aeon Friday. Yeah. Like, oh yeah. I'm going to miss this place. I think all <laughs> oh of us are going to. We had a lot of really great memories here. A lot of fun tournaments too. Uh, but hey, uh, speaking of fun tournaments, uh, go to Alpha 6 that's uh, happening this summer in August. Oh, fire. almost hit him with the fire hydrant. And the back air oh, beautiful, is yeah. gonna do it. Sinji taking that lead back. And now, going back beautiful to the ledge. Back air, back air. not gonna clean not it up. Do it. Honestly, I think the fact that it got staled on the fire hydrant might have been the reason he lived there. Because hitting the hydrant does stale your move. Oh, good A land. Players love doing that A land with the down air where it's like they're faking having the hitbox out. Yeah, honestly, I have seen Sinji find so much value out of just like the little fruits this game that is insane. Like those little strawberries, the little cherries, the oranges. Like he's just nickel and diming. They're PK not gonna Chris. do it there. Yeah, honestly, like super close up. Did you guys see that? Yeah, you like. He used the trampling, but it didn't put him in landing lag. He like auto camped. That was really neat. I think it was neat. like the last hit of it. Right? Like, that was really yeah. neat, actually. Sinji showing us all the unique tech this game, right? I uh, wish that. But shortly after, Chris is going to take that stock with the up air, and we are at last stock, pretty much this even percent. This is the percent. first time we've been even this game. I mean, hopefully Chris can try to keep this lead now, because any sort of advantage that Sinji gets from this point on, he's going to try to run away with. You don't want to give him any sort of percent lead, but that's going to... Oh, no, not, not the follow-up. And now we're like, by point two, Chris still has a percent lead. Yeah. Now, 
Yeah, literally gonna play two, and not anymore. Not now, since he gets to play the game plan, he would want. I mean, put three. Oh, wow, oh, that nice was so tech, tech, That was a yeah. beautiful tech. Though. I wouldn't have teched that. I don't think I would have. I, I would have died. Oh, oh that back air is dying. gonna wow. take and it, and Chris off. with the pop off. Okay, feeling himself, drinking water, stay hydrated, friends. It's okay. hot outside. It is 90 it's degrees. It's hot outside and inside. It's, it's hot inside. <laughs> Please stay hydrated. Drink your water. Drink. See, Sinji taking a sip too for the people. Everyone at home, stay hydrated, please. Yeah. Crank up that AC as well. Yeah. Bro's deep in thought. You see that? Who? It's Sinji. He's thinking He's like, about all right. he wants to He's thinking, how can I improve? Oh, we're going back to FD. Okay. Uh, no stage pick. No stage change. This is a comfort pick for both of these players. Yeah. I mean, both their characters really just like the flat phase, no platforms. The platforms really just mess up both of the game plans. I mean, with Pac-Man, you can't drop the hydrants easily onto the floor anymore. You have to find the specific spots. Ness, obviously, the platforms can extend to help with your extensions as well, but also like, allows you to speak, like the ability for your opponent to mix up where they're going. Very limited. Also, PK Chris is just loving down tilting these hydrants, just to like, keep them low to the ground and use them as an active spot. Oh, how much damage is that going to be, though? Oh. Also, 50. forces Pac-Man to stay back a little bit in the event he wants to approach with the Hydrant as a safety net. That down tilt can just poke through. True. It's also just scary looking. Like, the exact angle it's going at. Oh, yeah. Like that? Yeah, like, that's that's horrifying to me. Any angle is scary with that Hydrant, in all honesty. That is true. Like, they're just staying on their respective side of the Hydrant, throwing you throwing things at each other. Yeah, but I mean... PK Chris randomly just took 35% for just accidentally landing in the wrong spot. He existed like, a little too hard. Yeah, no, actually. Like, Pac-Man's ability to just set up those nice little traps and just keep Nash from landing in the spot that he wants to is just getting Sinji so much damage. And, like, it's not like Pac-Man's traps don't do damage. Oh, no, Ooh, yeah. yeah. I mean, the you bell can, you can, can't, excellent. you cannot whip punish in front of Nash, uh, Nash, in front of, uh, Pac-Man holding bell. It is genuinely so good. Misses the hydrant twice with the nair, but the down tilt is going to get that hydrant out. Okay, the big All right, let's see the Galaga set up. 40% just from one Galaga. Finger wag, not gonna do it. We're gonna need that one more good hit, I think. Oh, uh, that up smash would have been it, but I mean, Sinji rolling away, being really sneaky. Really smart get up option there from Sinji. Oh, good orange. Oh, uh, that's gonna be it, though. Another gonna back do air. It. And these backers are honestly being like the saving grace for Chris right now. He's been really unable to find much else to find those stocks except the backer. Oh, that might right, be ground scary. ball there. Honestly, <laughs> I wish he would F smash the Galagas a little more, like if when he gets the chance. But I know oh, it's hard. Right. You can do that. Yeah, you can. Uh, you, can you can reflect it. Uh, you get thunder. Nope, just the third. Just the flat. Up there. Oh, I mean, but we're getting a lot of damage right now. Oh! oh! That was almost it. Such Fear. a good nair there by Sinji to get rid of the PK rocket. I believe Pac-Man's nair is frame 3 or 4, so very, very fast. Very good to just mash when you're in those scary situations. Oh, looking to smash that Hydra again. Oh, right uh, this is a scary part. Oh, good parry. But now again, bro, like, relatively even percentage. Yeah, I mean, this is what Chris is looking for now. Just keep it even, keep Sinji pressured, and having to have to find his own spin. Honestly. And in a way, this forces oh, Sinji to approach. Okay. Nice this up is smash the first there. biggest stock lead that Chris has had, I think, the entire set. Let's see if he can capitalize off of this and get some bonus percenter, or Sinji's just going to clean it right back up with this key. Oh, Good big parry. parry. That's going to the foot montage. Okay, we're grabbing the bell. Honestly, yes. Oh, the bell's just gone now. Ooh, oh, wait, that was that really was fancy. Smart. Using the active hitbox that was still there to act as the first hit for that. Oh, yeah. Good. Honestly, it's huh? kind of... Sinji's kind of looking for, like, a lot of setups to find his build right now instead of just, like, looking for, like, a, maybe a backer at ledge or something. And it feels like Chris is super aware of, like, all the little Off stuff the jump Sinji's there. For. That's no, no, that's not going to do it. Yeah, yeah, that was way too early, but the next one that's missing. Okay. Oh, but the, uh, the apple, the no, apple no, it's not. not quite. One more of those I think should he might, do it, I though. think he might just throw it again. Like, I, he, have, he still has that. Or apple. possibly from where he was look for a back yeah, throw. the apple again, but nothing. That's, That's it. it. Nice yeah. spot, spot dodge read, and Chris is Chris going to take off. it. Two one over Shinji. I mean, genuinely, with how that first game started, I did not think that Chris would have been able to pull it back, especially that dominantly at the end with the two stock. Like that game three started with Shinji in the lead. 